So today Andy Gent's going to talk us through the painting process of how the opening mounting shot was created. So over to Andy. Last time you saw us, we just got the set covered in the texture, which is uh, sort of plaster and a little bit of grain in it to give it some, some nice texture to help the paint take and it homogenise everything. So that was in this sort of colour scheme we used the last time you saw it. So this is a sample piece, and then you can see the paint tests that we've put on that Laura's done um, that will give you different kinds of that feel, that Death Valley, that rich red sort of sandstone and how it can be eroded and how it can get some warmth into it or you know fractures of different sort of sedimentary rocks and all the rest of it. So this gives us a, a style sheet and then we've applied the one that we think is the best to the set. And this is it now, we're always just finishing in some little details on it here. So when you see it from the opening shot of the film, uh, we've created this false perspective so the road's very wide at the front and then very quickly it disappears back to being miles and miles away in the distance and everything's cheated in with that perspective. So right at the foreground you've got the large cellular sign that the buzzard sits on and the large cactus and the tumbleweed just like rolling <laughs> across and then as you get back everything dramatically reduces in size so the cactus gets small quicker between that cactus and the paint pot, they would probably get sort of a third of that height and then disappear, so they'd be super small. Because we're trying to create the illusion that this set is absolutely massive and goes back like the Arizona Desert. What we're just about to do is the background mountains, which are smoother in texture. If you notice, these have got more texture on them because they're closer to us. The darks are a little bit richer on these because they've got more of the actual sort of shadow in the tunnel. As it gets to these bits, everything should be slightly misty because there's a lot of atmosphere between you as the viewer in the far distant background. So we're trying to create that. So we're just going to slightly knock that back with paint, and then this will be down to the DOP to light to get the rest of the sort of feel to it. That's it. Ace, thanks so much for watching our video guys, we've got so much more exciting things to come. If you like us, please subscribe to our channel, Lonely Sticker Dynamite, tell your friends, we want to make this a success.